Hey, welcome, my name is Oli, and today I will present you my top 10 gaming mousepad of 2023. So in this video, I will show you what are for me the 10 best gaming mousepad that have been released this year. A lot of pets have been released, some interesting and unique, some less interesting. I review most of the mouse pets in my top 10, but not all of them. But I have a lot of playtime on them, so I can give you a good opinion. So, let's get started with my number 10, the Soku Shiro Mousepad. A solid hybrid pad with a standard rubber base, it has a nice design, a bit expensive for what it offers, but it's a limited edition. What I like with this pad is the community behind. I'm curious to see what they will bring in the future. Number 9, the Nif Pad Control from Nifter. This one is my budget pick of 2023. As the name say, it's a control oriented pad. Very accurate and precise, but you have still a good glide and speed. For a price of around 30 euros, a very solid budget gaming mouse pad for me. Number 8, it's a tie, the Pulsar Super Glide and the Pet Smith Empress. Two great glass pads. This year was definitely the year of the glass pad with so many releases. I put these two glass pads together because they feel very similar. I like the good ratio of speed they provide, it's a bit slower than a sky pad which makes it a bit easier to use. Moreover, the design on both pads looks amazing. Number 7, the 4114 Aero and Kuruson Ninja. It's again a tie and it's again two speed mouse pads from two new brands which are both very promising. The Kuruson has a unique, interesting, fast surface and a great design. The 4114 Aero is also very solid, just a bit slower, so maybe easier for micro adjustment. The quality built on both pads is very solid. If you like fast mouse pads, these two pads are definitely worth a try. Number 6, the glazed glass mouse pad from the whale. For me, it's the best glass pad of this year. It's slightly slower compared to the Pulsar Super Glide and Pet Smith Impress I just picked about before. The main difference is here is the smooth surface and the feeling of my skin on it. I don't need sleeve to use the glaze. Moreover, the price is very competitive in this giant size of 500 by 600 mm. Number 5, the Pulsar ES2 mousepad. Here the limited aim trainer edition. I love this hybrid surface. It has an alpha cell base which is very sticky. The quality overall is very solid. I spend a lot of time on it and the pad is very durable. Unfortunately, I didn't have time to make a review. In my opinion, it definitely deserves to be in my top 5. Number 4, the Lamzu Energon Pro. Another speed oriented pad, a surface similar to the Dawnfinger Destroyer but with Poron Base. It has a very good speed, the friction is perfect to also enable some micro adjustment. I like this one a lot, I mean it for a while, the quality is great. If you are a speed pad enjoyer, this one is to consider. Number 3, the Saturn Pro Soft Mousepad from Lethal Gaming Gear. After the successful Saturn Pro Extra Soft, Lethal Gaming Gear released this year the soft version, which I personally prefer. I just got it recently and I didn't have time to make a review and to compare it with the Saturn Extra Soft. So I will do it here very short, the Extra Soft is slightly slower, so with this soft version you have a bit more speed I will say. The quality feels very premium, it feels that it has been improved even if the quality of the Extra Soft was already amazing. Definitely a solid versatile pad, a banger for 2023. And my number two is the Vagabond mousepad from Infinity Mice. It could have been my number one. It's still one of my main gaming mousepad of 2023 and probably also in 2024. A great looking pad, it has a balanced speed, the texture on the surface is similar to the X-ray pad Aqua Control, but it's thinner, has great stitches and a very solid custom base. Just perfect for me. And finally, my number one is the Endgame Gear EMC Plus and Artisan Zero Orange mousepad. Yes, my number one is a tie. Two great control mousepad I like a lot. Artisan released this year the Zero in this amazing orange color. It's nothing special, only the color. I already love the Zero and now in this color it's just great. I don't have to present Artisan mousepad, they are top quality. Choosing Artisan is safe. The EMC Plus is another one that surprised me. Amazing quality as we know from Endgame Gear, correct price and a big 500 by 500 mm size. A bit slower than the Artisan Zero, but perfect for control games like CS2. I mostly switch on the EMC Plus when I play control oriented games. So that was my top 10 gaming mousepad of 2023. It was a great year for gaming peripheral. I hope 2024 will be at least the same, if not better. I hope you enjoyed this top 10. If not already, please drop a like and sub to the channel. If you want more info, you can also follow me on Twitter or X, where I post some news and what is coming next. Thanks for watching, and as always, see you next time. Bye bye.